I just remember sitting at the kitchen table one morning on a Saturday, reading the paper, drinking my coffee, having breakfast, thinking this is two hours that I could donate to uh, a center or, or someone that needs this kind of help. And so the following week, uh, my son and I, he was probably six or seven at the time, we went to the center in New Albany and knocked on the door and, and asked how we could uh, volunteer. And that's how we got started. I have volunteered for uh, about 26 years since the early 90s. And uh, it has been one of the most rewarding experiences I have ever had. There was a New Albany Center off Charlestown Road uh, where I did most of my work as far as building maintenance. And they had housing for clients there. And so there was always something to do there, electrical, plumbing. They had showers and, and restrooms there also, as well as laundry. My mom, uh, she was the greatest person I knew. And uh, she was my biggest fan. And uh, she just loved to have fun, uh, very family oriented. She didn't have any help with us growing up. You know, she was tending to an alcoholic husband. She just got by on a shoestring budget uh, because of course uh, the abuser had control over the money and she wasn't allowed to work out of the home. He had all the power and the control and that's the way he liked it. And uh, yet she still rose above all that and uh, was just a great mom to, to me and my sisters. I'd say age 70, she went to a, a, a singles dance uh, at the Catholic Church uh, for seniors. And uh, it was just like uh, the old junior high days, all the men on one side and the women on the other. And she noticed a tall, slim man tapping his foot. She went him to ask him to dance. And uh, they were married a year later. And uh, they, were, they were such a wonderful couple, uh, the love of each other's lives. My mom passed in the early 90s and uh, she was 93. And um, I had been working at the center for a while and uh, she knew that, she was proud of me for doing that. And uh, I just wanted to do something that she would never be forgotten for being a person of perseverance and courage. And uh, so I had this plaque made for her and they were good enough to allow me to do that. And uh, I, uh, I put it in myself and put it in concrete and uh, I don't think anybody could move it because it weighs a ton. I think people really want to make a difference, but they're, they don't know how to get started. And they don't think they have the time to do it or, uh, or whatever the excuse may be. But uh, I can tell you, if you start with just an hour a week, it is just so rewarding that uh, you'll get hooked. I'd like to thank the Center for Women and Families for this award. Uh, it's uh, unexpected, unnecessary, but greatly appreciated. Uh, I wanna thank my mom for instilling courage and perseverance in me, just watching her as I grew up. Uh, she is truly a hero to me. And uh, anyone that's thinking of uh, volunteering, I would encourage them to consider the Center for Women and Families. It, uh, it's a wonderful place that offers a wonderful service 24 seven for those in need and those in crisis. And thank you again for this award.